Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I've got some hair issues. But, welcome to my channel. <laughs> I'm Reed and this is Reed's Beauty Trip. And we are going to do my A Little Goes a Long Way. This is a fantastic collab that some of us ladies, the Lori's, Sherry, the Andreas, all of us that are doing this together, Brandy, who I love and adore. <laughs> this is for us to use up like our body mist, our smaller packages, our samples of fragrance. So earlier in the year we did the Big Bottle Showdown, which was our bottles of fragrance. Now we're moving on to the small sizes. So let's go through my empties. Let's just say I had a successful first project. So this is the update. Let me grab everything out of my little thing. Oh, I put that in the wrong one, didn't I? That goes in sample size blitz. Mm. Okay. Here we go. Mm. So. Mm. I'm excited. Because I accomplished a lot. So we're going to do the itty bitties first. Mm. So these were like the samples. So these are the three. Mm. I did finish them. Mm. So there's. Um. The Joe Malone Nectar. I like this one. The Nectarine Blossom and Honey Cologne. Is it in my hand? Okay, somewhere I've laid it down. But I really like this Joe Malone one. Now, Joe Malone. <laughs> That's a grub Gucci. Uh, it was nice. It was a nice scent to wear during the day. It was a nice scent to wear to work. It wasn't overpowering or anything, and it just gave off that nice warm scent. So I really did enjoy that. Is it on my top 10? Mm. Did I wish it was on my top 10? No. <laughs> um, the next one I had is the Toka Giulietta out of Toka. This is my number one favorite favorite fragrance by Toka. Um, I love Julieta. It is just, it's just one of my favorites. I'm like holding these all in my hand. Um, it was, it was one of my favorites. It is my favorite. This is the second time I've tried, tried this in a sample size. If like I was able to pick one fragrance from each line for Toka, it would definitely be the Julieta. Just, wow. I loved it. I did. A must. My other itty bitty, Gucci Bloom. Out of all these, this one really, I was pleasantly surprised. Would it be one of my picks for Gucci Bloom? Yes. This is the Ambrosia de Fiore. And I enjoyed it immensely. I wish I had had more of it. I feel like there's a little. I wish there was a better way to get, like, if I could put these in, like, a bigger spray bottle and spray it. But this one. And there's just itty bitty 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 one. I can't get it out. But yeah, this, oh my gosh, definitely um, on my list for if uh, Christmas gifts. Mm. Gucci Blue. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Mm. The next one, which was a linen spray. So I actually put it in my air. Because um, it's deodorizes and refresh. I have it in my body mist section. And this was, I actually have three bottles of this. I'm pretty sure I got it for my grandson. And so, but he has not been over. So I used it in my room scenting stuff. So like for my humidifier, I just put a couple drops in it and um, used it. Because I don't want stuff to smell like food or dessert in my house. Not, you know, bubble gum. Because it is, it's called literally Will it focus? Bubblegum Sparkles. And it's by Abby and Sullivan. And I bought a three pack of it. Like I said, it's a luxury room and linen spray. And yes, it makes your room smell like it's a candy factory. A little goes a long way. And I have two more bottles of it. So you may be seeing more of it. I haven't decided yet. Would I repurchase this? No. <laughs> There are some regrets in one's world, and uh, not that I regret it, but I will not repurchase it. If I repurchase it, then I may regret it, because like I said, 
I have three bottles of this. It came in a trio. <laughs> All the same scent. You would think when it's a trio, there would be three different scents. Not so much. <laughs> the other one I finished was my Daisy by Marc Jacobs little guy. It's the original. I love it. I just want to touch it. Touch, touch, touch. You know this. I miss when they had the little dabbers. And you could just dab, 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 dab. So the bottle. I don't like doing this. It's empty. That's the only reason I don't care. Because I don't want skin flakes getting in my jar. Because, oh, that would be... Mina! Ugh. No, be dig She's digging on the pillow. She's digging on the couch. I don't know. But yes. This one, um, the original Daisy. I think I like... I don't know if I like Oude Fresh or Dream better. But Marc Jacobs came up with such a... This, this Daisy line. Even, like I said, the little bottles are just adorable. Mm. So, yes. This is not on my list either. <laughs> so it has been used up. Um, I think it's, I can't remember if it's Daisy, I think it's Daisy Dream that I like more so than Daisy. But it could be Daisy Fresh, or Daisy Love, or Daisy whatever. There's a Ladybug one too that I like, and I can't think of what it's called at all. And I'm sure someone will tell me down below. <laughs> so, all five, all empty. Happy dance, happy dance, happy dance. Okay, mm. So, next on to, okay, so the Itty Bitties, fresh by Mochino, and the bottle does look like this, the full-size bottle. Unfortunately, the sample does not, but I do like the Mochino Toy too. so we're going to see how we like fresh. J'adore by Dior, I have friends always, always saying, oh, you need to try it. This is an iconic Dior floral. It is iconic. Um, I don't know if it's iconic for me. Essence of Lang Lang, which, oh, you know what? I wonder. Okay, I'm putting that one to the side. Because I'm going to send it to a friend, I think. I don't want to do that one. I want to do this one. Okay. I have them over here. So, actually, okay, so Jador. We're not counting Jador. Jador, I think I'm going to send to a friend who loves Lang Lang. She's all about that. Lang Lang. It also has Damascus Rose and Jasmine Grande Flor or Gras. With Jasmine and Jasmine. Two types of Jasmine. So I might like it. But I'm going to save it for a friend. Mm. Ralph Lauren Romance. I love this. I've owned it full sized. So I, I know I've purchased this <laughs> full size. So chances are I will still love it and will purchase it full size again. But we're going to use up the sample size. Mm. The next one is, this is the one I, so many people have told me that I'm going to, the YSL Black Opium. It's on my list. We're going to see if I like it. Here's the sample. And if not, if I do, I will buy the full size. End of conversation. Because I feel like I will. Does it, let us open it and see if it's what, the, what, what color, what, what colors, what fragrances. The sensuality of coffee. Oh, mm. we're starting with coffee. <laughs> Hello. Uh, surrounded, sensuality of coffee is surrounded by the aura of magnetizing note of blue absence. The thrill of a mysterious and daring addiction electrifies the new black opium. Coffee accord, licorice absolute, vanilla absolute, and absinthe essence. I'm... It definitely has my attention. <laughs> It has fragrances in there that I'm like, mm, I don't know about the licorice, but coffee, vanilla coffee, absinthe. Mm. <laughs> this may be a rebuy or a full size buy. Mm. So the next one is one of my itty bitty DKNY. I don't know which one. <sighs> be tempted. <sighs> I bought this cute little two set and they were two little guys. And I love DKNY. I have most of them. <sighs> This will also probably be a full-size purchase, but we will find out mm. after. Mm. And then my body mist. This was in my A Little Goes a Long Way last year. This is my Vera Wang Embrace Marigold and Gardenia, which I love. This is what I call one of my wedding scents, which I layer with the perfume and the body mist. I have a couple of these. I'm trying to thin out a lot of my body mist. 
this is halfway. Do I think I'm going to finish this in a month? No. Do I need to mark it? Yes. So. Oops. Is it? Okay. So the top of the circle, I need to get to the bottom of the circle by my next update. That's the plan for this one. Um, so let's tape it so it doesn't move. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was like, I keep looking at it like I'm paranoid. The other four I do want to finish up this month, but this one, we're going to do it one dot at a time. So the goal is to finish this much, this update. <laughs> and when I hit the bottom of it, then we'll, you know, I'll decide if I want to move this out. Because I don't know if I want to finish it all because I do like to layer it. And I have so many other scents that I want to work on too. So um, it's a work in progress. Mm -hmm. I have a bottle where I've lost the top and I can't match the squirts with it. The squirts, that sounds bad. The spritzer part. This is th These are what I call wedding scents. They're soft, subtle, floral scents. But the thing is, is the spout is broken on the other one. So when I finish this one up, I will probably put this other fragrance in this bottle so I can use it up. But... So these are my five, my itty bitties, Black Opium by YSL, Romance by Ralph Lauren, and the cheeky one, Fresh by Mochino. Fresh Couture, Fresh Couture, sorry. Fresh Couture by Mochino. And then another one of my, Donna Karen's, which is one of my favorites. This is the Be Tempted DKNY. So I'm excited because these are all Fun scents. I'm excited to wear. I need to put them in the spot so I don't forget to use them or lose them, which happens occasionally on my table. Things happen. I blame the cats. I really do. They're mischievous. You wouldn't believe how many socks I've had dragged or shoes in weird places. And then my body missed. So, like I said, I've abused this poor bottle. This bottle has been just rolled around, abused. It was in one of the drawers and it just kind of, I don't know what happened exactly, but yeah. So that's my fragrance. My little goes a long way. Please check out the other ladies and they are wonderful. Hanging with Lori, L'Oreal. L'Oreal sounds Lori L, but you can call her L'Oreal if you want to. Uh, Andrea M. Andrea, it's all about the face. Brandy Kirby, she is on Instagram. Sherry Ward, she is, I'm waiting for her to get her minutes because she's got enough subscribers, so she should be getting, I think she's got her, she's been monetized. So, yay, Sherry, just a little shout out to Sherry Ward. So check her out, she is like a very big sparkle princess, pink sparkle princess, I'm just saying, and I love her to death. Um, the Jador, like I said, I am going to send this to a friend who likes like mine. <laughs> Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you didn't like it, thumbs down. It's fine. Also, comment below if you feel like commenting below. Um, if you've tried any of these fragrances, what you think of any of these fragrances, if you know, and so forth. Also, if you have any questions. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. When I hit 300, there will be a big drawing and giveaway. But not until I hit 300. I love you all. Talk to you soon.